Hello everyone, I am the Squeaking Lion, and today we are going to be hunting King the Katanga Lion. Uh, we are going to be using the tranquilizer rifle here. Okay, uh, so as you can see, we are in Damba, and we are at the balloon. Uh, the best way to find King... Uh, King is a little hard to find, uh, mostly because uh, he blends in well, uh, just like all lions. They blend in very well with the grass, and this grass is very tall, so it's kind of hard to see uh, King from the ground. Um, so the best way to find him is actually to go from the balloon to there straight to where you pick up your horse. Uh, the, the, the horse in this area is named Rasta. And you can see the, the campfire and the tent kind of from here, although it's kind of hard to see with, with like how tall the grass is. Uh, but what you're going to do is you're going to head towards the campfire and towards the horse symbol on your mini-map. Uh, this is the best way to get to the first, uh, the first leg of, of, of your trip here. And then once you get here, we'll go ahead and hop onto Rasta here. Uh, and we're going to kind of make our way around and we're going to point ourselves in this direction to the northeast you can see in the distance you've got that big kind of group of boulders there with the two trees on top you're going to head yourself towards the left hand tree um, and you you're going to go a ways but it's not going to be too terribly far uh, not like uh, trying to locate uh, some other things that are here in Damba, since Damba is so large. Um, and that's one of the reasons why it's so hard to find King the Katanga Lion, is because uh, this is a great big huge area. And so it's not surprising that you might not be able to find uh, King the Katanga Lion. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to go past this little herd here. We're going to make our way up a little ways. He's around here. Now, he does wander, and it's usually best to be on your horse uh, so that you can see him, and there he is. As you can see, you can hardly see this guy. Uh, he moves through this grass, and it's like it's he practically blends in. He's really hard to see. And at night, he can be really difficult. Um, now, like all lions, uh, King the Katanga Lion hits like a truck. Um, he's very fast, um, and if he catches you, boy, you will feel the hit. Uh, but also, like uh, most lions, uh, male lions require two shots with the tranquilizer rifle. Now, uh, female lions only require one shot with the tranquilizer, but uh, King, and just like all male lions, require two shots. Um, now, this is a problem, uh, because when you shoot him, he falls, he, he falls in through the grass, and quite often it's very difficult to find out where the heck he went. Um, unfortunately, um, in this game, the grass does not mat down uh, and get smooshed down when, a, uh, when an animal falls. So, unfortunately, you're kind of having to look for him in, th in the grass. And as you can see, he blends in really, really well. So, you don't want to shoot this guy from a distance because you could quite easily lose him in this mass of grass because it's all the same color as he is. So, just a heads up, you're going to want to get him so that when he's right up close to you, or if you happen to find a bear patch somewhere in this vast expanse of, green, uh, of, of uh, golden grass, uh, maybe you can draw him there and pick him up there. But that's a very important thing to pay attention to, is that it's really easy to lose his unconscious body in this grass. So you're going to want to shoot him up close so that all you got to do is look down and just maybe adjust a little bit to find him but there you go king the katanga lion and that is where you find this particular legendary creature